are trying to make it poison, and we are not going to let that happen. Right. right now, GMOs are created for two reasons that both involve pesticides. A seed's gene is engineered to stay alive when high doses of pesticides like Roundup is applied to kill weeds around it. Or a seed's gene is engineered so it can produce its own form of pesticide that kills pests that try to eat it. There are no health benefits from GMOs, and GMOs do not increase yields. Both these things Monsanto says just aren't true. GMOs are primarily created by six chemical companies. Monsanto is the biggest and most pervasive. Others are Dow, BASF, Bayer, Syngenta, and DuPont. All have spent millions, tens of millions, in other states to block consumers from getting information off to the labels. These companies are right here, right now, trying to do the same thing in Oregon. Besides Roundup that's used for GMOs, other chemicals Monsanto has produced include DDT, BAN, PCBs, which has been banned. Saccharin, it's also been banned. RGBH growth hormone, highly regulated. And Agent Orange, which has been banned. But the EPA may approve an Agent Orange ingredient, 2,4-D, to put on GMO crops. GMOs have not been banned. They're not regulated, and they're not labeled. To this day, Monsanto does not admit that Agent Orange has killed members of our military. Too many veterans have suffered and died from Monsanto's Agent Orange, and too many families' lives have changed forever. This is not the America that we want. We do not want Monsanto to control our food with chemicals they created for war. On this Memorial Day weekend, we take a moment of silence to remember our heroes.